Hello and welcome everybody. GTII stock on 13 December. Let's see what's the steps in this video about the price prediction that can be available for everybody. And let's see what this price prediction can be applied on this stock. If you are new to this video, don't forget to watch this video until the end. Subscribe, like for price predictions that can be done for everyone in this stock. So according to what we want to share about absolutely this is going to be one of the things that should be taken on consideration so i think this is going to be the thing that it matters when we see the gti i explained here that it would go through this part and increase but this is not going to be the only price predictions that can be applied, and we can go for another price predictions so for example if we see gti i would be in this movement so that is going to be accurate and absolutely movement good movements so that is going to be an important thing that can be done on our mind and we can see that it's going to be the second price prediction instead of the first price prediction okay it's going to be form of letters and this is going to be form of letters as a good thing and then it's going to be an intersection here and this intersection could be preventing wave to move more than its value its current value here and or more than its profit or more than the limited value that it has stopped then it has tend to make a rebounding bar and then it would decrease in momentum here instead of the increase in momentum so let's see what would happen after the decrease in momentum after this decrease it would be forming ladders this ladder would give us about uh, five trend lines between this line and this line that is going this is a basic thing in gtii to be done because this is going to be one of the things that can be uh, matters for gtii stock and let's see what we can go for the next time so for example we we see that the trend line here is going to be the second one or second trend line we have the previous one which is going to be this trend line so this is going to be an accurate movement that we drew here it would increase and then stop here and then decrease a little bit maybe it can go for a price like this and then spike immediately to go uh, to a certain value with a certain period and then it make boom spike and then goes to be rebounding right like this and it can repeat this process again until it reaches this value and the number of trend lines that it has based would be uh, it would give us an indication through this part okay because this is going to be about the part where our resistance also has a rebounding part here or a, a part here either it can be rebounded by a trend line or rebounded by a slope line okay i think it should be a common rebounding bar commonly rebound, uh, rebounding by a slope line so that is the basic thing in GTI okay however let's see what this another thing is that can be important if we think that it can be done on three hours update it gave us a wideness in sh a white chart and this is about uh, what we want to go for uh, next time on if we say that we have another stocks like uh, bbig molin maybe all of this stock can be available for it to make its uh, good increase or decrease okay however this is very good thing to be indicated and let's see with a nice thing that can done or matter and we see that that it would increase next time again 
because it, we have here about seven cents only and below zero USD there is no moving value and that was good thing the good news about what we could explain on the matter on the things that matters on the video and the thing that going to be about also the GTII is going to be um, maybe one of the things that can give us in additional uh, movements additional uh, prices that should be appreciated and this is going to be also in instructions about I always simple things okay in our mind maybe if we check it out that is a plan for what we see for investors or sellers but it's all it's commonly for investors because it decreased again here okay and for who didn't sold this stock uh, had lost a lot in GTII and this was an unfortunate thing uh, uh, and we have to return the back and wake up for this part okay this is the thing that we should take care about because since you have to check out that is a spike decrease okay don't think that it's a price that has been lost but it goes to make a decrease in spike and then increase in spike or increase in immediate increase momentum and you can return in this place and sell it with high price and that was good difference so for example if you see that the person that has sold it from this part and this part it will sell it by five when he buy it by two you will get a profit about three usd if you went for uh, this part, three usd and 55 and here is going to about two so you will earn about one usd and 50 cents and that is the thing that we mention for every stock and this is what i could see in the why uh, in the world of stocks about united states canada and other um, another country's stocks this is the thing that can be for the GTII to be explained that is because when we see the future of GTII maybe okay maybe fading maybe if you see that it's not going to return back again it may go like a MTLB since it had its appeared on 13 December and it has went for a lot of news there are they are going to have this news uh, it's going to be fine maybe a fine news maybe it returning back again but it has uh, erupted and it uh, may not return back again like uh, also red box that i could not return back again and that's what i can think about this stock nowadays good luck